Hello Bitcoin world, it's Brian here, the UK Bitcoin master, back with another video in my series, Bitcoin for Beginners. Uh, today is Thursday, the 29th of November, 2018. And as always, firstly, uh, Bitcoin to the moon. And secondly, have a very strong hand. Um, as always, like the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel, please. Uh, bash the bell button so you're notified when I post videos. I try to post two a week. Um, follow me on Twitter at UK Bitcoin Master, on Steam it at UK Bitcoin Master, on BitTube, on DTube. They're all at UK Bitcoin Master. So very easy to remember the one at uh, UK Bitcoin Master and follow me um, everywhere. Um, do check out the notes section below because there's notes relevant um, to this video if there's any needed. Um, there are links below to buy t-shirts from Bitcoin to the moon. Um, my good friend down in Australia, he ships them all the way around the world. Um, there are links there to my uh, Bitcoin Master archive so you can watch all my previous videos. Uh, there are links there to buy a Trezor, um, to register with local coin Bitcoins or Coinbase. Um, everything's down there. So do check out the notes section below, please. Um, so today I want to talk to you about the masses. Um, if you've ever heard of a guy called James Kahn, now James Kahn is one of the dragons, or was, sorry, was one of the dragons in Dragon's Den UK uh, several years ago. And before he went on to Dragon's Den um, as a multi-millionaire, um, he was interviewed by the BBC and he, they asked him for his top 10 tips for anyone um, who wanted to you know, become an entrepreneur. And there were 10 great tips in there, but one tip that I really resonated with, and he said, observe the masses and run the other way. Observe the masses and go in the other direction. So how is that relevant to Bitcoin? Well, it's easy. What do the masses do? They panic when they hear the, the mainstream FUD, the fear, uncertainty and doubt. They sell their Bitcoin when Bitcoin's crashing down. And you know what? Here's a thought for you. Ignore what the masses do, because anyone that knows anything about success in business, they know that when everybody's selling out, you should be accumulating, and never more so in Bitcoin. Isn't it interesting? Now the price is right down, nobody's talking about Bitcoin, nobody's buying Bitcoin, but you know what? People are buying it, but it isn't the masses. It is those astute enough to understand what's going on. And the really interesting thing is when there's a bull market, everyone's buying, everyone's talking about it, everyone's excited. Well, you know, if you understand this space correctly, what you should be doing is wait until the price is low and then quietly accumulating. Because by the time mass hysteria has taken over, it is too late. Bitcoin's going upwards, it's climbing, it's going to hit a high, and then of course it's going to taper off again, as it always does. It's cyclical, it's done it in the past. What I'm trying to get you to understand on this video is this. Never is there a better time to buy Bitcoin than right now. The price is really down. Now you might say, oh yeah, but it's gone right down, so it might go to nothing. Look at, look at everything that's going on behind the scenes. Start to understand the technology of Bitcoin, the fundamentals of Bitcoin, um, why the world are looking at it, why the banking institutions are studying it, watching it, looking to get into it, but they're not shouting it from the rooftops yet because they don't want to be laughed at or ridiculed by all the other mainstream companies, corporations and media. But mark my words... If you, the ordinary common man, do not understand this basic principle, you will never make money at anything, never mind Bitcoin. So buy when it's down. Ignore what the masses are doing. The masses are piling out of Bitcoin. The weak hands are piling out of Bitcoin. Don't do that. Buy when it's low 
but don't expect rags to riches. This is not a get rich quick scheme. It is a buy low, the next bull run will come round next year, the year after, whenever it is, and that price of the coin you bought will only go up and up and up and up and up. If you want to then top out and sell it and hold your money till it comes back down again, but it won't come back to the same level, that's okay. I would strongly advise you don't do it. I would strongly advise that you buy your Bitcoin as low as you possibly can and then hold it until at least May 2020 when the halving takes place, 2024, 2028, as Bitcoin gets scarcer and scarcer and scarcer. Honestly, guys, do not follow the masses. Um, there's been a statement bounded around for years now since I've been in my other entrepreneurial business, and that is that something like 5% of the world's population hold more wealth than the other 95% lumped together. That's got to tell you something. The 5% know something that the 95% don't. So apply that theory to Bitcoin. Become part of the 5% or as Adam Meister likes to refer as it to the 20 percenters. You know, start understanding this thing. Follow the YouTube commentators that we all follow that really are pro Bitcoin. They're not, you know, full of stupid comments and rage. They're just common sense, decent people that understand that you've got to buy low in Bitcoin and you've just got to wait the process out. And if you do that, maybe you'll come back, you're watching this video maybe in 2021, 2022, and you're thinking, oh my God, he was right and I didn't buy. Or maybe you're thinking, yeah, he was right and I bought and now look at it, it's 4X, 5X, 10X. Hey, none of us know. All I know, you need to buy low when nobody else is talking about Bitcoin. It doesn't mean there's anything wrong with it and then wait for the highs to come again. Whatever you do, don't do what the masses do and buy when the hype machine's in full flow because then it's all over in terms of the top it's going to hit and then it'll have another retracement back again. But what you need to understand is let's say you buy it at $4,000 and then there's a big bull run in a year, two years, next year, whatever, and it maybe goes to 30 or 40,000. Yeah, it might jump back down 60, 70, 80% and it might settle back down to 10,000 again or 5,000 or 6,000 or 7,000. But the chances of it dropping right back to where you bought it from they're pretty remote. Of course, they're possible. You know, I always say there's nothing guaranteed in this because the only thing guaranteed in life are death and taxes. Seriously. So, but in all fairness, if you look at, if you study Bitcoin since 2011, you'll see that every bull run, once it's retraced, it's settled higher than the previous low. Yeah. So again, Buy Bitcoin now. You are never going to get another opportunity to buy Bitcoin at $4,000. It just ain't going to happen, guys. So buy low when everything's quiet. Get it off onto your Trezor. Um, if you want a consultation on how you set up an exchange, buy your coins, get them off your coins onto your Trezor hardware device and secure uh, your coins then email me below. I'll be happy to set up a consultation um, with you for a tiny amount of Bitcoin in payment. Um, it is better to do that than it is to do something wrong because you think you know it all and lose your Bitcoin. Yeah, don't do it. OK, uh, contact me below if you haven't got started and you want to get started. Buy low and then wait it out. Thanks for watching, guys. That's our show for today. As always, have a strong hand. Buy your Bitcoin, get it on to, off an exchange onto a Trezor, and then wait for the price to go again. Delay your gratification. You know, Don't let it grow and then pull it out and, and um, spend it. Wait for it to grow until you've accumulated what you're after with your strategy. That'll do for today. Again, guys, as always, please like this video, share it, subscribe, bash the bell button on YouTube. If you're watching this on Steam It, uh, do give us an upvote and a re-steam. I'd appreciate that. You might be watching it on BitTube. Again, give us a thumbs up. Um, wherever you're watching it, guys, thanks for watching. Please support the channel, and I'll catch you all on Monday. Have
have yourselves an amazing Bitcoin day.